Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Max with A1 Website Pro and in one of my bank accounts I have PNC to, uh, you know, for some uh, transactions and everything. Uh, I called them because I needed the, uh, the transactions for all of 2018 and uh, <laughs> I, I didn't have because I'm getting ready to close this bank account out and they said there's no way to download CSV files from online and it was at the business bank account and it was a total crock of crap. So what I did was I started posting all over Twitter and Facebook. And I was tagging them and it, telling them how horrible their bank was. And then somebody else ended up getting a hold of me and telling me, yeah, you can do it. And this is how you do it. It's kind of hidden. So if you're in your uh, my account, you got to have to go to my account. And you could go to a summary or account activity. What you want is this online statements. So make sure you click on that, and I'm downloading them, you know, so you, you have to download them 30 days at a time. And so here, uh, I think I have uh, one, two, three, yes, now I'm on April. So I select April, I, I click Activity Detail, make sure all activity is selected, and then I hit Export, and uh, I can hit the Download, and then I put number four. Okay, so I'm downloading the whole year one month at a time and this is the person um, communicating with me I got off the phone with him and the, the, the guy on the phone told me that I could not do it so it was he was full of crap they wanted you to, you to buy something or buy some quick and crap and do your stuff through there as well uh, I got to the bottom of this and I thought that, you know, since I was so frustrated, I would share it with somebody on how to do it with PNC online banking whenever you, you need to do your taxes and uh, you don't want to sit there and enter all the transactions one at a time. Uh, now you can take the CSV files and import it into your uh, tax software or whatever you, whatever you need to do. All right. I'll thank you all and uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial.